You are the icing on my cake. You are the smile. Hey everyone, I'm Mindy from Cute Girls Hairstyles, and I'm here with Sweet Pea today. And we're gonna do our first official hairstyle tutorial on Sweet Pea. Now we've had lots of you write in and ask for um, tutorials specifically for toddlers, but today's hairstyle is actually one that kind of crosses a whole wide range. It goes up from this toddlers all the way till like that. teens, in my opinion. So we're just gonna demo it on her. Okay, now you're gonna begin by making a part on one side of her head, and then you're going to, I've already made two little puffs, well not puffs, but like rubber band this, them. That, so I, I made a part here, that. and a part here, and today's gonna be a noisier this, tutorial that, than usual. And then you make three sections going back. So we wanna do three. Come on, here, pull this, pull that for me. So you gather up the hair for the third little section, and this is a trick that I learned, particularly on hair texture like hers, is to take a toothbrush, I know this is gonna sound weird to Caucasian people, and you take a little bit of your product, this is just a hair, um, like a moisturizer, like a little bit of a style slash moisturizer, and you just run it right into the roots like this, and you kind of comb all those little baby flyaways down, and it just helps prevent the hair from like fluffing and getting too um, endy looking right away. That's all this is done. So we're just putting that. For some reason, the, the bristles of a toothbrush work really well on this hair texture. Now I'm gonna take an elastic. Now on their type of hair texture, you never, ever, ever wanna pull the elastics out. I always cut them out. <gasps> and try to use elastics really sparingly because it can damage hair if you're not careful. So go ahead and put the elastic in. And you wanna make sure it's not too tight because we're gonna be flipping it under. You wanna make sure there's a little bit of wiggle room there. Okay, now I'm gonna take a topsy, tool, a topsy tail, and you can find these on Amazon or eBay. Just Google them, you can buy them. They're only a couple dollars. If you don't have one of these, you can always just make the little hole with your fingers and flip them under too. But I'm gonna do corners. So this is a <laughs> corner flip unders. So I'm gonna go from front, from the front corner to the back corner Daddy. like on a diagonal. And then I'm gonna take her hair and tuck it in and just very gently oh. pull it through and it's just gonna flip that whole puff underneath. Gosh. And we have our first slip under. Now I'm gonna go and do it to the second one. So again, I'm gonna go from the front corner to the back corner and give it a little gentle tug. Hey. And you can see that I didn't have it tight enough to even hurt her. And like I said, you can always just use your fingers to make that same hole. I just find these are a little bit less tugging on the hair. My kids prefer them. Flip this third one under. Ow! And we have our little flip unders. And now Ow! I'm just gonna go back. Bye. I'm gonna put a little bit of moisturizer right here in her hair. A little bit of, and just retwist any little pieces I want. Like I don't love the way this one's looking. Let's just give it a little twist. And we have Lucky. Uh -huh. That's so cute little puppies, huh? Little triple twists. And you can even go back and add little clips right here if you want to. Whatever you want to do to help. Add just a little accessorizing, a little styling. Now to show you that this is not just a toddler hairstyle, I actually did it on a couple of my other kids. Come here, let's show you. So this is CGH number four and we did the same thing. Tip your head down on her and see her little triple flip unders right there. Corner flips. And then I added curls with the curling wand. Put your head up. And this would be a great one to do if you're growing your bangs out or if you have short hair because you don't need any length at all to be able to flip. Okay, you can go, thank you. Okay, and then this is CGH number three. And she's a little bit older so we wanted to make it a little bit more grown up look. So we actually did, tip down so they can see. Again, the corner flip unders and then we just let him fall to the side and then we took all of her hair and scooped it up and did a really messy fishtail to accent it. So this just added a fun little accent top to the top of her hair without being quite so flat and boring. 
So there's lots of ways you can play with this style. You can mix it up, you can use it on babies, you can use it all the way up to teenagers. And I think you'll really enjoy. It's so simple, but very easy and fun. So we hope you guys enjoy, but don't forget to check us out on Instagram. It's at Cute Girls Hairstyles. And there's a particular reason you're gonna to wanna to be following us on Instagram for the next couple of weeks because we are officially announcing What's happening? We are moving. We are moving. So we currently live in Utah and we have decided that it's time for CGH to make a change. So we will be moving. And I want you to leave a comment below and tell me where you think we're going. So if you leave a comment below, tell me where you think we're going, city and state, and see who can get it right. We won't tell you until next week where we're actually going. But by the end of the week, we will be packed up and on our way. So please be patient with us for the next couple of weeks. We're filming videos before we go, but with any move, it always gets a little crazy and sometimes you don't even have internet. So please be patient with us. We'll be doing our best to make sure that you get a hairstyle every Sunday. And we will see you guys next week. Bye. 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 Bye.